I'm Kristen Davis. I am a senior here at the University of Tulsa. Um, I got involved with the cybersecurity workshop because I first got involved with Hour of Code. We've done six different hours of code here hosted at Helmer Call with ITU. Um, and we have brought in hundreds of Girl Scouts. Well, just this fall, there were cybersecurity badges released for um, daisies, brownies, and juniors. That would be girls from five to 10. And today, because the juniors had something else that they could do, we just have daisies and brownies. So we have five to eight year olds and we're teaching them about cybersecurity from staying safe online to protecting your passwords and how networks talk to each other. We've got them rebuilding computers so that they know how to rebuild it and not take one apart. And we're just trying to get more girls interested in cybersecurity as it is a predominantly male dominated field. And we want to start them young because as soon as they're in fifth grade, they don't think that they can do it. And we're here to teach them that they can. There are three badges for each level that were released so that for a total of nine badges. We're planning to do this event every semester. So we already have dates scheduled in the spring where we'll do the next badge up in the series. So by the time they get done with that, they'll have two of the three and really hope to spark some interest in completing all three. I was a longtime Girl Scout and they approached me my freshman year about starting Hour of Code, which is just an hour to get girls excited about coding. And from there, um, the cybersecurity badges were released and they asked if we were interested in doing that again. So I teamed up with Amy Cairns, who was a CIS major here at TU and we got ITU involved and we've just gone from there. So after I've graduated, we're still planning to have ITU take this on and get even more college students involved in help raising the next generation of network engineers.